Welcome to English in a Nation with talk shows. I'm going to use this course from talk shows to demonstrate why and how certain intonation patterns are used in English. Hi, I'm Wing. In this video, I'm using the discourse of Benedict Cumberbatch and Jimmy Fallon from The Tonight Show. Let me show you the sentences we're going to go through. I've got a lot in common with Bigfoot. I think Santa Claus owes me a present. 39 people subscribe to my fashion blog. Weathermen are great dancers. <laughs> Aliens should be called Outer Space Boys. I actually butt dialed Michael Phelps and it changed my life. We're going to start with the first sentence. I've got a lot in common with Bigfoot. This sentence only has one intonation phrase with one tonic, which is a big, as in Bigfoot. The pitch starts from a neutral pitch, rises to a higher pitch at the tonic, big, and falls to a lower pitch after, at foot. This indicates a declarative sentence with Bigfoot being the main message of the intonation phrase. I've got a lot in common with Bigfoot. Next sentence. I think Santa Claus owes me a present. This one is similar to the last one. It also has one intonation phrase with one tonic, which is the pre as in present. Similarly, the pitch starts from a neutral pitch, rises to a higher pitch at the tonic, pre, and falls to a low pitch after, at sin. This also indicates a declarative sentence with present being the main message of the intonation phrase. I think Santa Claus owes me a present. Next sentence. 39 people subscribe to my fashion blog. This one is also similar to the previous ones, which also has only one intonation phrase with one tonic. But this time, the tonic is not at the end of the intonation phrase, but in the middle, which is the P as in people. Similarly, the pitch starts from a neutral pitch, rises to a higher pitch at the tonic, P and falls to a low pitch after. This also indicates a declarative sentence with people being the main message of the intonation phrase. 39 people subscribe to my fashion blog. Next sentence. Weathermen are great dancers. This one starts to get a bit tricky. It has three intonation phrases with we as in weatherman, great and dance as in dancer at the three tonics respectively. This happens because Benedict wants to bring out three messages in the sentence, which are weatherman, great and dancers. Similarly, the pitch rises to a high pitch at the tonics and falls to a low pitch after. Weathermen are great dancers. Next sentence. Aliens should be called outer space boys. This sentence has two intonation phrases with a as an alien and space as the two tonics respectively. In this sentence, Jimmy wants to bring out two main messages, which are alien and space. The second intonation phrase should be called outer space boys. It's nothing special. It has a similar intonation pattern to the ones previously explained, in which the pitch starts from a neutral pitch, rises to a higher pitch at a tonic, space, and falls to a low pitch after, at boys. Should be called outer space boys. However, the first intonation phrase, alien, is where things get tricky. There are two things right here. The first one is that the pitch didn't fall to a low pitch after the tonic. It's because Jimmy did a pause after pronouncing alien. So to indicate that the sentence is not finished yet, a leveling tone is used rather than a falling tone. Alien. The second thing is that you may hear that the tonic, a, ah, is not at an ordinary high pitch. It is a pitch which is even higher, an extra high pitch. Why does this happen? It's not hard to explain. The answer is the stronger your emotion, the higher the pitch will be. Makes sense, right? So this extra high pitch indicates that Jimmy was actually having a stronger emotion when pronouncing the word alien. Alien should be called outer space boys. Next sentence. I actually butt dialed Michael Phelps and it changed my life. This is by far the sentence with the most seemingly complex intonation in this video. It has an insane amount of five intonation phrases with but as in butt dial, my as in Michael, Phelps, change, and life as the five tonics respectively. Fortunately, all the intonation phrases actually aren't that complicated. Each of the intonation phrases indicates a declarative phrase, in which the pitch starts from a neutral pitch, rises to a higher pitch at the tonic, and falls to a low pitch after. In addition, the my as in Michael, change, and life are pronounced at the extra high pitch. I believe it's because Benedict was holding his laughter and his emotion was strong when pronouncing them. I actually butt dialed Michael Phelps and it changed my life. Let's try to perform the intonation of these sentences slowly. I've got a lot in common with Bigfoot. I think Santa Claus owes me a present. 39 people subscribe to my fashion blog. Weathermen are great dancers. Aliens should be called outer space boys. I actually butt dialed Michael Phelps and it changed my life.
Hope it helps you. And if you're interested in acquiring a standard English accent, click the link below to get a free gift. This video ends here. See ya.